And welcome back to the long run where we are playing Spyro Year of the Dragon Reignited. Last time we beat the game! And uh, we only have a couple of things left to do, one of which is this spark stage. So rather than do this spark stage, which I am going to remember is between Harbor Speedway and Dino Mines, I'm going to take a different route real quick. Over here to Desert Ruins, I believe is where I need to be. Is it? I already forgot. <laughs> well, crap. But behind one of these stages... I can remember which one it is. Hang on. Maybe I was not, because uh, I, I did have to look this up. And now I'm just thinking maybe I wasn't shown everything that there was to see about where this is. Now oh, that's the rocket ship. That's Agent 9. Only I could look something up, be like, all right, I am sure of where this is, and immediately be unsure of where this is. There it is. Yeah, there was a little mark on that, which uh, indicated, please hit me. Billy! Billy! Alright, Dino Mines, Harbor Speedway, hey Zoe. Just before you kicked the sorceress's big, fat, ugly butt, she built a factory to make robotic bugs. They're meant to fight sparks, but I don't think they're any match for him. Well, let's do it. Also, I didn't address this. Uh, I must have missed it, but um, why are you not a fan of the fact that you get the gems back? I think this is the kind that I actually have to dash into. It is effectively a son of a bitch. There we go. Like the idea that the gems have an actual use. Well, th that's the thing. Like when, uh, like by the time that you get your gems back, they no longer have a use. Like the use is to get into the super bonus land. Not 
Alright, thanks for giving me that key. <laughs> ah. I wish there was a better indication of, like, where do I go next? Like, you got a key, but where does it go? The, that the number of gems can definitely be pretty uh, inflated, let's just say. But I don't know. It, like to me, it's fun because I, I like I like being able to search for like every little thing as long as it's not like ridiculously hidden in an overly expansive world, much like uh, ukulele, for instance. Well, that was the last egg, but apparently I did leave behind some gems. Yeah, there are ten gems somewhere. And we absolutely need those gems. There they are. That is 15,000 out of 15,000. And here comes the most useless spiral perk Oh, you're not even going to give it to us, okay. Um, in the original game, the Spyro perk you get from this is that Spyro, as that spark, uh, sorry, the Sparks perk rather, that you get from this is that Sparks will be able to break through um, all of the pots in the game. If you've been doing the game 100% up to that point, it is completely worthless, because there are no pots left. I mean, it's definitely going to be worth something, kind of, 
if you have can you please stop if you haven't actually been uh, getting everything up to that point but um, yeah anyway super bonus round has opened up we're not done yet so salty that you never got Octopath Traveler's final boss part. I'm still salty that I never finished Octopath Travel. Like I need to get back into that game, but it's it got so grindy. Hey, you finally made it, Spyro. Hunter was a little worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress, but I always knew you'd beat her. This place is where the sorceress kept all her treasure. But after she was defeated, a bunch of thieves came and stole it. If you Sons can catch bitches. the thieves, you're more than welcome to keep the treasure. Oh, by the way, Hunter is around here somewhere. He's been tinkering with one of his new toys all day, and he wants to show it off. You should go see him. Oh no, it's not that damn skateboard again, is it? I forget if this is a, a flight stage. No. Son of a bitch! That... <sighs> Juked me. Camera, please. There we go. Well, that's a bit gratuitous, isn't it? Son of a bitch! Nope! Also get rid of this, cause uh... I was just gonna get in the way. There we go. Here's another one, son of a bitch! Not really sure what happened there. I remember Octopath being grindy beyond the final boss, maybe one slide. I have gotten all of my characters to chapter three, and no one met the minimum level requirement for chapter four. So I don't know if it's because I'm playing the game like in an unintended fashion or what. But, um... Yeah, that wasn't great. Also, son of a bitch. So yeah, there are various doors here that are going to require us to get uh, certain amounts of gems. here because oh uh, really not really sure how I'm meant to be dealing with those UFOs now, there's probably a power up gate somewhere because I haven't seen it Oh, I can't I can't actually 
hit them with my regular fire anyway. So there has to be a power up gate somewhere. How many gems do we have? 15,943. But just not enough to open that gate. And actually, Sparks paying here is probably not going to be particularly useful. Ah, uh, here we go. Son of a bitch! Come on. There we go. That'll give us enough for the 16,000. I just have to find that door again. And y'all know how good I am at finding my way around the stage. There we go. Bianca, she was really worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress. It was pretty funny. She tries to play it cool, but she was scared stiff until you came back safe. I just finished fixing okay. up an old submarine. Why don't you try taking it for a spin? Want to take my sub for a spin? Yes, Great. yes, yes. Hop aboard. Stop asking. But yeah, we're, we're doing another one of these. So this time there are no loose gems. You get all your gems by busting these guys. Yeah, I actually managed to get one of them. I don't know if you noticed. I actually did manage to get one of them without locking on. So it is possible. It's just not practical. There we go. And that takes us over 17,000. Should open this door. Oh no. Check it out. This is the world's fastest turbo snowboard course. The local champions are the Sasquatch Six, a gang of Yetis on souped up snow discs. I bet that you could outrace the lot of them. If you win, we'll get a huge pile of treasure. If you lose, I'll have to slick down the whole course with my tongue. Good. So, ready to race? <laughs> I should lose on purpose. Right on! Just don't lose, or my tongue's gonna be a popsicle. Also, why do they get to start without me? Like, they started moving and I hadn't even gotten on the course yet. sure what happened there but okay uh, uh, what the what the hell just happened Ready to race? Ride off! 
the hell was that? I mean, I, I didn't mind the, um... I didn't mind the submarine mini-game. That, that one was alright. I did not particularly want to do this mini-game again. At least I seem to be far enough in first that it doesn't really matter. As long as I don't mess up completely. I might have to do the course a second time just to get the rest of the gems, but uh, that's fine. So I'm not going to have to race. some shiny stuff too I will say one thing they made it a lot easier in the remake but it's it's real easy to get your uh, your boost meter to full in this version so that was a lot of gems then if you noticed uh, did we miss any? Yeah, we did. Ah, I see some up there, yeah. I'm gonna do at least one full circuit around and make sure I haven't missed any others. But it doesn't look like I did. Doesn't look like these crabs are holding out on me either. I 
I think those are the only ones. Um, yep, sure enough, Spark is pointing back to the portal. Okay, where to next? There's a door that said 18.5 on it. I don't think it was this one. Yeah, no, that's 20,000. Nope. Ah, over there. That just took me all the way around. Back to the 20k door. Great. It's not like this is a big stage, it's just I'm bad at navigating. There it is. And there that is. Oh, and it's not permanent. And they do fight back. Also, the geometry fights back. Yeah, although this isn't uh, semi-permanent, like they could have made it, it has a really long gauge. I don't really have to worry too much about refilling it. They don't fight back. Maybe I just ran into something the first time too. Or in some cases, you know, ran into nothing. Anyway, there's one left. Oh, I can't land on that. Good to know. trying to land in order to get a bead on where that last one is. Oh wait! Sparks is pointing at it. And that should be the last of the 5,000 gems in this stage, which will open the final door. What lies behind the final door? We get to fight the sorceress again. She did it, Spyro, but the sorceress must have survived that last battle. She's been waiting here all this time, saving up her magic to destroy you. Oh no! Your best chance at defeating her is my flying saucer. I've cast some spells to give it extra firepower and unlimited flying time. The rest is up to you. You've come this far, Spyro. I know you can beat her. Pretty sure I can.
That's pretty much just keep tailing her unless she turns around to fire at you. And this is effectively the second real phase of the sorceress fight. Don't ask how she survived. Yeah, being thrown into the lava. But hopefully she doesn't survive getting thrown into whatever this is. The death water. Yin Yang. Wait a minute. I was told there were 150. There, that, was, that last one was twins. Great jello, my only weakness. There are the dragon daddies, by the way. <laughs> and then, just for good measure, they give us the credits again. We're not going to do that again, though. We've already done it. I'm not the smallest one anymore. Well. Hundred and twenty per cent Spyro, hundred per cent Ripto's Rage, hundred and seventeen per cent a Year of the Dragon. I think we can finally call this let's play to a close. So that is it for Spyro Reignited Trilogy. Thank you to everyone who has hung out during this series. Uh, Tyrion, Jewel, Zero, J Pop. Um Probably some others, and I should I should really make some way to track everyone who has visited uh, and participated in chat for all of these. Um, that is on my list of things to do, but my list of things to do is so damn long. Anyway, the next scheduled stream is going to be on Sunday at 8 p.m. or later, Atlantic Standard Time. It is the Sunday Super Shuffle. And we're going to do some more Archipelago shenanigans. And that takes us around the week, round the wheel to our next uh, long run stream next Tuesday at 9 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time, where we shall be starting, by request of Mazzy, Chrono Trigger. Uh, and hopefully I can also get some uh, more work done over on the other channel, uh, picarto.tv slash felicitousneko, um, where I am planning on doing some more work on, um, on bumper stickers tomorrow at some point. Um, and yeah, I think that's about it for tonight. Thank y'all for watching. I'm Coolio if you don't know. And I'll see you guys next game. <laughs>